this idea just came to me. It's based off the Bedini flyback captures idea. So battery A is your source power. Battery B is your load. So is this coil. Together they're in series to negative. You switch it here with a transistor read or a hall switch. Whatever. This could be a damaged battery. As long as it has some continuity that coil will charge up with that amount of continuity. And once it's disconnected from the circuit the coil will fly back and this will become a positive instead of a negative and it will smack the C battery here so as this battery loses impedance and gains continuity this coil will receive more energy and so will battery C. I personally think the unipole uh, circuit that I have in my channel is more efficient because it's only two batteries and the pulse bounces between the two in one 360 degree cycle it does it twice per battery 90 degrees so when the pulse happens from A to B, that would be 90, 90, 90, 90. So it bounces back 1, 2, 3, 4. Four times does that circuit supposed to bounce the pulse back and forth. Yeah, well, I just thought I'd write this down real quick. It was an idea that came to me. It probably has some potential. I definitely think it has some potential for something. I, I still think, like I said, the if you look at my other videos, the one called Unipole, open source Unipole uh, uh, circuit. It uses two batteries. It pulses one coil. Uh, twice, no, four times, sorry, per 360 degree turn of the rotor. It has two magnets on it. Anyway, check it out. I'll post a link. Over and out.